Hello, welcome to Spooligan HQ, aka the Spoolie Den. Hope you like it. Um, just going to take this opportunity to talk about a version of one of our existing products. Um, the Spooligan Ding, which is our bait stop for the dongle rig, we've had some fantastic feedback, so thank you for that. Um, I've been using it, uh, some of our ambassadors have been using it, and it does exactly what it's supposed to do. So it's a great piece of kit. Now, one of our ambassadors, uh, Lee Byrne, phenomenal fisherman, uh, approached me with uh, a request. Could I scale the ding down to a miniature version for targeting smaller species or scaling down your rig, etc.? So the mini ding is perfect for that. So to put it in a bit of context of how I'm going to use it, I've created what I call a DDL, double dongle loop rig. Some of you may already have this rig. Uh, it's just the name that I've coined for, for my purposes. Um, so basically, it's a loop rig, but using dongles in a smaller format. So I can put my smaller, um, sometimes softer baits on there without them being pulled off. So the mini ding will hold it in place. I'm going to use this rig on a session, which I'll drop the footage into now. Um, see how I get on. So. Keep your eyes out. It will be available on the VMO website shortly. Thank you very much. Okay, the little DDL rig that uh, I mentioned in the spoolie then. Now baited up, ready to go. So on my bottom hook, there's a small sandy eel squid wrap. And on the top hook, I got cart with squid. Just in case there's something uh, fancies a little bit of crab action so that's baited up mini dings in place on both baits let's get it out there see how she casts and fingers crossed even a fish Well, that's the DDR rig. Uh, it's been out there about 20 minutes now. It's bright daylight. Fontagary fishes in the dark. This, this isn't a mark for conditions like this. Today was purely to get a bit of filming done uh, for some of the products we're working on and the mini dings, etc. So uh, let's bring it in. Let's see how it's performed and let's take a look. Okay, that's the dongle rig back in or the DDR rig as I called it. So. My cart and squid, still intact, ding still in place, no fish. Sand eel squid, ding intact, no fish. But as I said, Fontagary really is best at uh, lower light, so sort of end of the day, beginning of the day or at night. It's really not a venue for daytime, never really had a great deal of success. I've chosen this day purely because we've got quite quite strong northeasterly so apologies if there's wind noise on the microphone and I live one minute away from here so it's, it's just for convenience today to do a bit of filming the fishing was kind of secondary if I'm honest but I think that's a good test of that DZL rig and the mini dings it's something I'll be adding to my arsenal and certainly certain venues where a loop rig really works you know your Ogmore on the ledges to the right hand side of the deeps that on small eyes and some of the smaller species I think will be a fantastic rig and that mini ding will certainly help. <laughs> 